Hello, good morning and good afternoon. A warm welcome from my side. My name is Jens Kramer and I'm going to present our new Ultramite XP portfolio. This portfolio gives us a boost in mechanical performance and now I would like to show our portfolio that you get a good overview about what we were doing in the past. So here you can see that we have a lot of PA6 glass fiber reinforced compounds with glass fiber reinforcements ranging from 30 to 50 weight percent. But we also have one PA66 glass fiber reinforced compound with 50 weight percent glass fiber reinforcement. In the case of the PA6, we have one so-called high-speed compound in our portfolio, but we are still working on all the other PA6 products to also make them in high-speed. High-speed is a technology that, in addition to the XP, gives us better properties during injection molding because the process will be much faster and much easier. Here is a short overview about the XP. The product profile is about increasing stiffness and strength and as well as increasing impact strength. But we also saw that using our XP technology, we were able to boost the energy absorption of those compounds during crash relevant situations. And for you as our customers, we offer the opportunity for new demanding metal replacements, new opportunities and freedom and part design, as well as cost savings and especially creating new parts for crash relevant situations. Here on this diagram you can see the outcome of an internal test we performed to mimic crash relevant situation. Typically a PA6 compound with glass fiber reinforcement takes up more energy than a corresponding PA66 component. But we can see that using our XP technology we were able to boost the energy uptake by more than 20% in even the PA6 as well as the PA66 compound. And this is something really interesting we think because this gives you really a new chance for creating crash relevant parts. Now I would like to go over to some potential new applications. If you think about demanding metal replacement, you might think about a PA66 with 50 weight percent glass fiber reinforcement but you also may think about a PA6 with even higher glass fiber loadings of 68%. This is from time to time being offered as an alternative. This is a really good and valid material, however, it has some drawbacks. For example, if you look at midline strength and surface properties, there's still a lack towards the PA66 with only 50 weight percent glass fibers. But one of the biggest drawbacks of those really highly filled materials might be a PA6 or even a PA66 is the problem that injection molding is really a challenge. So it's really hard to process these materials during injection molding and you have a lot of problems with abrasion of the tool during these processes. And therefore we see our new XP technology as a really good alternative for the demanding metal replacement because if you compare the PA66 with 50 weight percent glass fibers to the before mentioned PA6 with 60 weight percent glass fibers, you can see that the new B3W G10 XP offers a different product profile and gives you with respect to impact strength, tensile strength and elongation at break, huge advantages over the standard PA66 but it only lacks some modulus. This, if modulus is the only thing that matters for your applications, you might want to stick to a PA6 with the really high glass fiber loading. But if you don't have to, you can consider our XP technology as a substitution. And this comparison can also be done in the dry as molded state as well as in the condition state. If you're thinking about demanding metal replacement, you can see that our XP technology offers increased impact strength, higher elongation at break, and as I mentioned before, higher energy uptake. And therefore, we think that 
this gives you a better freedom in part design that you can make lighter parts by just reducing the wall thickness and we see our XP technology as a problem solver. For example, if you are working on a part and you are still struggling with the final requirements, you can use our XP grade to increase the mechanical performance of your part and finally get this part into the goal. Here is the, a similar comparison to what I have shown before. Now instead of the B3WG10, I'm comparing the A3WG10, so the PA66 version with 50 weight percent of glass fiber reinforcement, and we, we can do the same comparison here. On the one hand side, you have the standard PA66 with 50 weight percent of glass fibers, and compare this to a PA66 with 60 weight percent of glass fibers. These materials are in the market, and we are also offering such kind of materials but we see that you also have the same drawbacks as I've mentioned before for the uh, similar PA6 variation. You still gain a lot of stiffness and you also gain some strength, but you have severe drawbacks with respect to knit line strength and especially in injection molding because of the higher abrasion and the higher melt temperature of this kind of material. And therefore, we also see the A3WG10 XP as a valid alternative to this highly filled material because we still gain stiffness over a standard PA66 with 50 weight percent of glass fibers. But on the other hand, we boost the tensile strength by a lot and even impact strength and elongation at break are also significantly enhanced. And this is also true for the dry as molded as well for, for the condition state. And with this, I would like to draw some conclusions about our Ultramite XP technology. With this technology, we offer new opportunities in part design. You can think about a direct PA66 replacement, for example, a PA66 with 35 weight percent of glass fibers that can be replaced by a PA6 with the same amount of glass fibers. In our case, the B3WG7 XP. Using our increased mechanical performance, you can think about new metal replacements that were not accessible before. So therefore you can use the B and the A3WG10 XP to make these parts happen. You also can think about making parts lighter by using the higher mechanical performance to in decrease the wall thickness, making the part lighter that way and also using lower glass fiber amounts and with the reduced density you will always have a lower weight of the final part. And finally, you can think about new crash relevant parts that were not accessible before. And one final word about our XP grades, they are all coming in a black color that has excellent laser markability. A picture of the corresponding laser marked plate can be seen here on the right hand side. Now I'm at the end of my presentation and I thank you for your kind attention. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to ask us via our chat functionality. And with this, I say goodbye and I'm waiting for your questions. Thank you. BASF. We create chemistry.